how knights say it's true. Oh, I have a good deed for you, Sir Rob. Huh? You can help me clean my room. Knights do way more adventurous things than that, Orbit. <laughs> you have to see my room. <laughs> In olden days, knights roamed the country doing brave deeds for their king and anyone else who needed it. Ooh, being a knight would be so much fun. Let's find a place where we can all be knights for a day. Yeah! Ooh, that sounds like a mission. And you know what that means. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet. where we can be knights for a day. That sounds like fun. Let's see where you can go. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops, nobody knows. Buccaneer planet. A vast mateys. That's a super fun place to play. Verily, TK. But we want to be knights, remember? Emma, but clowns do silly things, not brave deeds. Oh, how about Castle Planet? Castles are where knights spend their days. Yes, the Castle Planet. Good choice. Get ready for countdown. <laughs> Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts. Remember?
Like you said, he's the boss. And as your boss, I now command you to do something more entertaining. Okay, how about a ghost? Right! As where two brave knights try to knock each other off their trusty steeds. Steeds means horses. I know that. I'm the king, and kings know everything. And this king says, let the jousting begin! <laughs> Like fun? You and Emma go first, Rob. <laughs> Good 
Fox. Well done, everyone. I'd say that means it's time to head home. Well, he's gone. Kind of like an honorary sheriff. You mean one of us can be sheriff for the day? I reckon that's the perfect job for me. Are you sure, Emma? Being the sheriff is a big responsibility. You have to take care of the town and make sure things get of done. Of course, and... I'm sure. I'm going to be a great sheriff. You'll see. what needs to be done around these parts. Hmm. Fix the wagon, sweep the porch, clean the stable, and... Oh! Feed the bull! Bull? Look 
looks like a family -a rodeo Uh, sorry, Rob. It doesn't say anything here about riding the bull. We're supposed to feed it. And while I do that, Rob, you can sweep the porch. TK, you're good with tools. You can be the blacksmith and fix the wagon. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> and you, Orbit, you can clean out the stables. All right. Well, come on on, y'all. Get a move on. Better not forget to close this gate when I'm done. Huh. We don't want a bull running around the town. <laughs> Easy there, big fella. <laughs> Aren't you a cute little dopey? <laughs> what in blazing saddles? <laughs> wondering what all the noise was. I think I fixed the wagon. All it needed was a new wheel, which I made using some metal and these old tools. Oh, great. We should take a ride. What about our chores? Don't be silly. There's always time for a wagon ride, partner. Hop on. Huh? Wait a minute. I think we're missing something. Where's the horse to pull the wagon? We don't need a horse. You've got rocket boots, Rob. Give us a push. Giddy up. Let's get this wagon rolling, partner. <sighs> All right. Hang on. Up the wagon. I am the sheriff after all. You two can finish sweeping up the town. All right. Come on, TK. Wow. Where did you find these horses, Orbit? In the stable. They were just itching to go for a ride. Well, you know, as sheriff. It's my job to make sure these horses are in mighty fine shape. Yeehaw! Right up, horses! Horses? I thought we were supposed to be doing our chores. You know, work now, play later. <laughs> Nobody tells the sheriff what to do. Unless they want my job. Are you challenging me to a duel, cowboy? I reckon I am. Cuddles? The bull. 
That's my pet name for him. He's such a cutesy little fella. Come on, Cuddles. Well, partner, I think you've truly earned that sheriff's badge today. You think so? Thanks. And we got to be cowboys and cowgirls for a day. I reckon that means this is one big mission accomplished. <laughs> mission Control? Hi, Rob. You're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? decided she wanted to be sheriff for a day. Only I was so busy having fun that I neglected to do the jobs I was supposed to do as sheriff. When things got out of hand, Emma realized being a sheriff is more than just wearing a shiny badge. It's about responsibility. Well done. I think it's time to go home. Better buckle up. Again. Sorry, I just get so excited thinking about Grumble Drawers and his school of magic. I wish I could go there. I'd be the best wizard ever. Wizard school? How fun would that be? Rock and robots, that's a great idea. And that sounds like a mission. You know what that means. <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet. Sounds like a great mission. All right, let's see where you can go. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops, nobody knows. That's a tall hat. Wizards wear pointy hats. Hmm, no. Wizards don't ride mops. They ride broomsticks. Looks like it might do the trick. The Wizard Planet. Excellent choice. Get ready for countdown. <laughs> Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts. Magic 
magic happens. Ooh. And this must be the castle's gardener. Gardener? I beg your pardon. I am Professor Grumblefrog. Meet you, Professor Grumbledores. I'm Rob. This is Emma, TK, and Orbit. We've come to learn magic. I suppose I could teach you a few tricks, but you'll need to listen carefully and. Flying sticks! As Orbit has discovered, our first lesson will be broomstick riding. <laughs> broomstick riding can be tricky, so listen carefully. First, hold the broomstick. So the tip is pointing up. Sit on it carefully. Then give a little push and... Hey, guys! Check it out! And away we go! Orbit, are you okay? I'm good. These... these broomsticks are broken or something. Your ears just have a little grease in them. <laughs> Attention, everyone. Our first lesson with wands is about to begin. Oh. Hold your wand up like so and say the magic words. Celium, Celium, Soon. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Now you try. Remember... <laughs> Celium, Celium, Soup. Got it. Celium, Celium, Soup. <laughs> Yay! Woohoo! It worked! <laughs> celium, Celium, Soup. <laughs> Excellent. And now, Orbit, you give it a try. Celium, Celium, Super Hairy Soup. Added a few words, Orbit. Uh, I thought it sounded better. Professor, I have a problem. A great wizard is also a great listener. Now, practice with care while I help your friend. Need a hand? No, it's okay. I'm a great wizard. I've got this. <sighs> okay. I'll be over there if you need me. Celium, Celium, Sabuka! TK? TK? Come now, students. It's getting late. Time for our third lesson of the day. Hopefully this one won't be as hairy. Hey, where's TK? <laughs> must have gone to the bathroom. I hope. TK? Oh no! I turned you into a chicken! And now for our third trick. Levitation. Everyone listen carefully and repeat after me. Peaky, pokey, pokey. <laughs> Instructions, Orbit. Oh, uh, no, it's okay. Um, picky, pokey, pokey. Oh. Oh. Orbit. <gasps> Not again. It's all right. All you need to do is repeat after me. Mm, I can't. I'm terrible at this. I'm dangerous. <laughs> Oh, TK, if only you could reach into your trunk and pull out a ladder or a pole or anything that could help. Like this? Shh! TK, I'm talking to TK! Huh? Ah, TK! You're not a chicken! No, I was just in the bathroom. <laughs> the 
listen carefully, Orbit, and you can help your friends. Repeat after me. Papa, Rata, Boomerot. Maybe TK should do it. I'll just make it worse. You can do it, Orbit. You're a great wizard, remember? Uh, would you mind repeating the words, please? Papa, Rata, Boomerot. Papa, Lotta, Boomerot! Well done, Orbit. I did it? I did it! Thanks for helping me. Uh, sorry for not being a very good listener. It takes courage to ask for help, and a wise wizard to listen well. And do you know what I've learned from practicing both? Anything is possible! Peaky, pokey, pokey! <laughs> <laughs> well, I'd say that's a magical mission accomplished! Mission Control? Hi, Rob. You're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? <laughs> we wanted to learn a little magic, so we went to the wizard planet. Professor Grumbledore tried teaching us how to fly broomsticks, but Orbit didn't listen to the instructions, and he had a little bit of trouble. Our next lesson was changing fruit into chicken. Orbit didn't feel comfortable asking for help and tried doing things his own way. We learned that if you ask for help and listen carefully, you can learn amazing things. Well done. I think it's time to go home. The buckle up. Bye. Clubhouse? A clubhouse! Yay! Well, that sounds like we have a mission! You know what that means! <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet! Sounds like fun. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops, nobody knows. Huh? The cheese planet? I like cheese, but I don't want to start a cheese club. Ew! A club that's on the stinky food planet would be too stinky. Look, a tree house. A tree house would make a great clubhouse. Yay! The Treehouse Planet. Excellent choice. Get ready for countdown. Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts.
Let's get this club started. Now the first thing we need is the club song. How about, um, welcome to our cool club. It's tons of fun and really, uh, hmm. We need a word that rhymes with club. How about hub? Tub rhymes with club? I got it, grub. It's tons of fun and really grub? Well, it rhymes with club. <sighs> Maybe we should forget the song for now and make up our cool club handshake. I've got some fun ideas. We have to make up the song first. After all, the club was my idea. But we already tried, Emma. Sorry, but anyone who wants to be in my club has to help with the song. <laughs> then I guess I'll just start my own club with no club song. Well, who's in? <laughs> a club without a song doesn't sound like much fun to me. I'm staying here. Oh. <laughs> yeah. oh, this is so cool. Okay, so how about we get started on making a cool club sign? Or thinking up a great club name? Sure. Later. Huh? Huh? First, we have to work out the special club handshake. Oh, how about this? First, clamp onto my hand. Okay. Then we spin around. Oh. Then down. Oh, or maybe we do, no, once around. Or, or how about this? I'm getting confused. Can't we make this sign now? I think it should be like... A sign is easy, Orbit. First, we have to work out the handshake. Well, I think a club sign is more important than a handshake. So I'm starting my own club. Anyone care to join me? Thanks, but no thanks. I've got a handshake to work out. Hmm. stuff that's not here, like songs and special handshakes. Okay, so what will we put on our club sign? A rocket or a meteor? Hmm, that depends on our club name. How about the Cosmic Chum Club or the Robot Galaxy Fun Club? First things first, the sign will help us find the name. The name will help us with the sign. Mm-mm. Sign first. Name first. Sign first. <sighs> Aha! So you give up. Nope. I'm starting my own club. Maybe I'll call it the No Song, No Handshake, No Sign Club. Club Awesome! All in favor? Figured out 
how we can finish my club song. We just pick another word to rhyme instead of club. Okay, how about friend? Our special club word is friend. And we'll stay pals through every twist and bend. Because the message we want to send is that true friendship will never end. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All, right. All right! Thanks, guys. Now next, let's get to work on that special club handshake. All in favor? Yeah! yeah. This is a big mission accomplished. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yay! Mission control? Hi, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? for our new club. But we had different ideas about what to do. So everyone made their own club. But then we had no one to help us do our stuff. So we learned that it's always best to work together. You get more things done and have a lot more fun. Well done. I think it's time to go home. Better buckle up. Five, four, 